When I saw the first movie in the cinema, you know, what I loved about it so much was this beautiful original idea um, that yet was so simple. And I think they're, they're always the best ones, you know, the simple ones that how could we have not thought of that be before. And I think in terms of films like this, I think people, people like putting themselves into the, into the f sort of shoes of the characters and they ask themselves, what would I do? And then, of course, you have the universality of, uh, universality of family. How do you protect your children uh, um, normally? And then how do you protect them in an extreme world like this? You know, it's, 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 it's very appealing. It's extraordinary to be such a fine, fine actor and then to also be an extraordinarily gifted director. And it's, that's not something you can learn. You know, you can learn the mechanics of directing. You can learn your way around a film set. You can learn the sort of vernacular of it. But to actually know how to tell a story, that's something innate. And he has that. And he's also, a, a, you know, a beautiful human being and a very generous person, you know, himself and Emily both. So yeah, it was a lovely environment to work in. I felt very, very pri privileged. I f felt a great deal of affinity for the character. I mean, uh, essentially, you know, you meet, you meet a character who is in a state of grief. And he goes in this wonderful, actors always talk about that journey, you know. But in this case, I think he goes in an actual journey and an emotional journey. And that's very satisfying to, to, to play for, for me. I, I'm, I'm interested in complex, conflicted human beings because I think most of us are complex, conflicted human beings. Obviously the world is expanding and I think the people that were curious to know how this world came to be will get a little more information. They will be teased a little bit more about how this, because it's kind of expanding outwards like that rather than starting big and going small, which is very elegant, you know. Um, so yeah, there will, be, there will be more revealed. John had a really, really strong vision of, of how this movie would look, you know. We shot in, in Buffalo, which is a beautiful place. I, I really enjoyed working there, but they have, you know, have a lot of these old disused steel factories and they look like some sort of ancient civilizations, you know, and we, we shot all on location. And they sort of become a part, of, uh, certainly become a part of my world, my character's world. Um, uh, but it still has that kind of sort of weirdly bucolic uh, atmosphere that the first movie, movie did. In that this would be a beautiful world, but wasn't for these creatures.